Pikachu and Zekrom GX Premium Collection box. We have it. It's finally here. It's in the flesh. It's in person or, well, at least for myself. But we don't just have one of these boxes that we're opening up today. Well, we are only opening up one, but I do have a second one, which I got by mistake somehow. If you guys want to enter the giveaway for the full box, brand new and sealed, make sure you guys stick around for the giveaway information because this box is a banger of a box. <laughs> Welcome to the channel if you are new and welcome back if you're already part of the family on this channel. We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers so if you guys want to join me on this journey absolutely consider subscribing. We do a lot of unboxings just like this and Pokemon vlogs as well and if you want to see what Pokemon card shopping in Japan was like the last couple of years I have a vlog I'll leave a link down below and we're going to go back to Japan as soon as possible for more Pokemon vlogs. So the really surprising thing about this box collection is that this card that is the promo the Pikachu and Zekrom Gold GX is not actually tournament legal anymore. It's from the older Sun and Moon era from Team Up, and uh, it's no longer like in the standard format because we've rotated to Sword and Shield onward. You can't really use it, at least in the tournaments I go to these days, but it is a really nice collector's piece, which is really cool to see that Pokemon Company decided to release this box. Like this box came out of nowhere. It surprised a lot of people because this is a card that was a gold card in a different Japanese set, which never released in English. And they also released a Charizard Reshiram version of this box basically as well. I'll have the photo on screen right now. And uh, this box was a GameStop exclusive. And I have some good news for you guys. These are actually still in stock right now at GameStop Canada. So if you want to cop these for the retail price that GameStop is selling them at, I believe GameStop was the exclusive retailer for this box. There will be links in the description down below. And if not to GameStop, some other reputable places or eBay or StockX. With that said, let's take a look at the box. And I got to say, opening this box, I do feel a little bit guilty because it is such a display worthy box. Like take a look at this thing. This thing is perfect for anyone who's a Pikachu collector and uh, it's just really, really well put together. Now, one thing to note in terms of pack selection, it looks like these two boxes have the exact same packs. So if you were curious about the packs, it's probably gonna be the same in yours or potentially the one you might wanna end up buying. So it's always good to know, you know, what value or what packs are gonna be included in your box. Cause this is more on the premium end of boxes. Typically Pokemon boxes like uh, the say the ones with four packs are like $20, $25 Canadian. This one was, I believe, $67.99 Canadian, uh, now on sale for $62.99. So a pricier price tag or more expensive price tag, but it does come with a bunch of packs and that sweet gold card you can't get anywhere else. So if you're a true Pikachu fan, this box is honestly a must have. Taking a look at the back of this box, it has some details about it. So let's just quickly read through this and then I'll talk about the giveaway. Take charge with Pikachu and Zekrom GX. Tag team pairings like Pikachu and Zekrom GX are totally in tune with each other. Able to work together to multiply their attacks into an unstoppable series, the Pokemon TCG Pikachu and Zekrom GX Premium Collection puts all the power in your hands. Ready to battle and ready to win. Just not at any standard events because it's now in the expanded format. The Pokemon TCG Pikachu and Zekrom GX Premium Collection includes one gold foil card featuring Pikachu and Zekrom. I'm just gonna say Pikaram for the rest of the video because it's way easier. One oversized card featuring Pikaram and 10 Pokemon TCG booster packs, plus a code card for the Pokemon trading card game online, which is safe to assume will give you this golden Pikaram in the online TCG, which I'm looking forward to stream some more of on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Nikotoxigay, currently ranked number three in Canada, by the way. On the ladder though, disclaimer, just on the standard ladder. <laughs> With that said, let's bust open this box, and as I open it, I'll talk about to uh, talk to you guys about the giveaway we're running for a brand new sealed box. So originally, these boxes were supposed to be one per customer. I ordered one and it got delivered, and I still saw that they had them in stock, so I was like, Hey, if I try and order one, I'm sure they're just gonna try and cancel it anyways. It was on sale for $5 less than I originally paid for the first one. So I was like, come on now, 
Let's see if I can get one for on sale. Uh, so I did, and it came in the mail in two days shipping. Like that was so fast, super, super fast. Unfortunately, they don't have the Charger one in stock or available. So I might have to pay resale for that one, unfortunately, but I'm probably going to because I love Charizard so much. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is help your boy get to 10,000 subscribers. Hit that subscribe button down below. You can turn on notifications if you'd like and hit that like button and answer the comment question of the day, which is because there's been so many awesome tag team Pokemon out there. What tag team Pokemon would you like to see a gold card version of? Now, we're probably never gonna see tag team Pokemon ever again, or at least for the next few years. But if you could have any tag team Pokemon be a gold card version, what would that tag team be? For me, ooh, for me, it's really hard. I have to think about that one. Maybe Blastoise Piplup. I think that'd be a really good one. And you're gonna get the brand new box completely sealed. I will ship it out to you free of charge. International giveaway. Good luck to everybody. Here's the Pikachu Zekrom right here. Really, really shiny card. I'm gonna sleeve this up in a second because I don't want to damage it. It's so, so cool to see this card in person. I never thought I'd see an English version of this card. Now, the thing that sucks about this box is uh, this jumbo card, it does not fit in those new jumbo binders that you can buy with the celebrations branding and stuff on it. This is the same sizing as the previous jumbo cards from the GX era or the Sun and Moon era. So I'm gonna have to try and get like a jumbo sleeve for this and just have it on display somewhere. But look at this thing, it's so cool. Cool, it looks like a trophy. Just for reference, typically the jumbo cards are four times the size of uh, a regular Pokemon card. However, since these jumbo cards are bigger, you can see it's like, more than four times the size like it's it's quite massive here it is uh, over top of each other there's all the texture that is seen on the regular version of this card is also on the jumbo version you can see all the texture that looks really really amazing yeah i hope whoever ends up winning this giveaway it goes to a good home whether you keep it sealed or open it up it's up to you of course and i'd love if you could send me a video when you receive your box so i can showcase who won the giveaway of course i'll announce the winner at the end of the month on november 31st what are the packs included in evolving skies evolving skies evolving skies chilling rain chilling rain Maybe one more, Chilling Rain. And we got Chilling Rain again, and more Chilling Rain. And two battle styles, perhaps? Oh, two battle styles. A lot of the more recent sets, I love the fact that they included a bunch of Evolving Skies because Evolving Skies is quite hard to find these days. Let's open up these packs and see what we can pull. And again, make sure you guys enter the giveaway so you guys have a shot at this box for absolutely free. And check out the links in the description down below if you guys would like to, uh, to cop this box for whatever it's going for at the moment, or maybe for retail from GameStop if there are still any in stock. I suggest you don't wait on the GameStop link because it's probably gonna sell out really quick. So link again in the description down below. But let's get this pack opening underway. We'll try and go through this pretty quick. Don't wanna keep you guys here too, too long. We got a reverse holo, single strike energy, and a holo rare, Hound Doom, that's awesome. This is like probably one of the best packs you can get considering it doesn't have like a ultra rare hit. So let's open up this next one right here. And uh, if this video uh, ends up getting like 300 likes and 300 comments for the giveaway, we will be able to purchase the Charizard Reshiram Gold Box. So I'll buy one of those too. And uh, if I have some extra uh, YouTube ad rev from the channel, I'll try and do a giveaway for that box as well. But here we go. Let's do the second pack of battle styles up next. See what we can get. And we have a reverse hollow corkle, I believe. Corkle, carkle, carkle. And oh, whoa, nice. We got a full art Bruno. Shout out to my boy Bruno. He gave me so many free W's in Pokemon Leaf Green. All you had to do was use Pidgeot with Wing Attack. Now we're gonna do an Evolving Skies booster pack. Let's see what we can get out of this one right here. And we have Reverse Hollow Pikachu, really nice hit. And a non-hollow, I believe Smeargle, yeah. Reverse, no, no, not reverse. Non-hollow Smeargle. We'll save the two Evolving Skies for the end of the video. Let's open up the five Chilling Rain back to back and see what we can get. If you guys are new to the channel, definitely uh, I'm, I'm happy you're here. Welcome, 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 welcome. And uh, if you wanna be a part of the community, you're always welcome to come back. You don't have to subscribe, but uh, definitely hit that like button and let the YouTube algorithm know that you mess with my channel, at least in this video. So you might wanna come back and uh, get recommended another video in the future. All right, we have a non hollow Bennett, I believe. Yep, non hollow single strike Bennett. Let's get to this next Chilling Rain pack. 
and uh, we are doing we are, we are doing a ton, an absolute ton of Fusion Strike openings. So if you guys want to see a lot of Fusion Strike content, I'll be opening up pretty much one of everything on the channel. So make sure you guys subscribe for videos for those uh, that set. We got Hollow Greedent. That's actually really cute. That's a really cute card. Dude, I'm excited for uh for Fusion Strike because Greedent is so Greedent VMAX specifically is super super cute. So I'm hoping I can get one of those and build like a funny Greedent VMAX troll deck because his attacks are actually really cute. I'll have a photo on screen right now of a Greedent VMAX. But here we go. We have a non-hollow rare rapid strike dug trio. And nothing else super crazy in that pack. On to our next Chilling Rain. And then we have one more Chilling Rain right after. I hope you guys uh, enjoy the speed of this video. I know it's a little longer because it is a new uh, new box release. I don't want to keep you guys here for too long. You're mainly here to see what's included. But for the pack openings, I want to just run through these real quick. These packs we've seen time and time again on the channel. So it's nothing too crazy, nothing out of the ordinary. But here we go, last booster pack of Chilling Rain. Let's do this thing. I'll do the card trick actually for this one. See what we can, uh, see if we can get some magic out of this. We have a reverse hollow Lapras. That's a solid uh, reverse hollow to pull. And, oh, a hollow rare. I can't even tell, Weevil, Weavile. Final two booster packs of Evolving Skies. I am going to save the uh, Rayquaza pack art for last. So hopefully you can, you know, pull the Rayquaza from the Rayquaza pack art. But we did pull that uh, full art single strike Hello. Bruno. So that was definitely a really, really solid hit to get out of this box. Hoping we can get one more ultra rare because there are 10 packs. Typically you're gonna get at least two ultra rares out of 10 packs because that's enough enough packs for the, uh, the odds to be met. But let's go. We have the, our second last pack of the video and it is going to be a non holo Gigalith, which is uh, very interesting because this was a white code card. I was expecting a hollow there, not even a hollow. On to our final pack of the day. And of course, make sure you guys enter the giveaway. I'll leave the instructions in the pinned comment down below. All you gotta do is sub, hit that like button, and comment down below what tag team Pokemon you'd like to see have a gold card. Also, white code card. So uh, let's see if this is another error pack kind of thing because um, the last one was also a white code card and we didn't get a hit. It's weird, the, the code cards don't even matter anymore. If you want a further explanation, check out my previous video where we pulled two VMAXs out of green code cards back to back. But here we go, final pack of the day. We'll do card by card this time. All right, we got a Skip Bloom. We got a Floral Flat, I believe. We got Drowsy. There were so many of those in Pokemon Go when it started up in 2016 here in Toronto. We have a uh, Zorua, really cute, really cute Pokemon. On to our reverse hollow, which is a dream ball. And our final card of the day is, ooh, a Thievil. So white code card, no hollow. 